I hate them. I hate the divorce papers, Charles. Mm -hmm. I ate them with ketchup. And they were good. I mean, they were good. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want me to get serious about this divorce? It's just that you always called our marriage a joke. So, so let's look at logic here. If A, we didn't have a serious marriage, then B, we can't have a serious divorce. We can't. Because the whole thing is just a farce, Charles. A farce that tastes good with ketchup. <laughs> I mean, wasn't it just last week when your dad asked you the reasons why you walked down the aisle with me and you said... This is good. You said <laughs> for the exercise. <laughs> you you you're a funny guy, Charles. You can have that one. It's a good one. Mm. Mm. I'm not crying. I'm laughing. I'm laughing because you are about to walk out on a woman who is infinitely lovable. For instance, Paul. He's lived. He's loved me since year eight. He may be a little bit creepy, but I mean, he, he really loves me. He's come on to me 127 times, proposed to me 47 times, and he's written me over 200 love sonnets. He sees something in me, Charles, and he writes it down in metered verse. And that's not the kind of thing you come across every day, Charles. I mean, someone who really loves you for who you are as a person. Paul may be insane, but I value his feelings for me. I'd, I'd never ask him to put his name to a piece of paper, promising to just switch his feelings off me forever. Yeah, that's what you're asking me to do for you. To say goodbye to, to that sweet voice, Charles. Those baby brown eyes, the way your hand feels through my hair just before bed. Those aren't things I want to lose, Charles. In fact, I won't lose them. No. No. I'll woo you. I've written you a sonnet. <clears throat> Shall I compare thee to a summer's day. Thou art more lovely and more temperate. Rough winds do shake the darling buds of May. <laughs> Not crying. I'm laughing. I'm laughing because it's just one big joke. I, I just I keep, I keep waiting for you to say. April Fools! <laughs> and then, and then I'll, I'll run into your arms and... But you're not going to. Are you? No. Of course not. It's not April. I didn't really write that sonnet. Paul did. I think it's good. The truth is, Charles, I hate those divorce papers because I can't stomach the thought of losing you. 